In this video, I will show you four important use of Shift key. The use of Control key is well known by Excel users, but what about Shift key? From my observations, the use of Shift key is rather underestimated. I want to show that Shift key can actually achieve lots of things. And I assure that your productivity won't be the same after you finish this video. So stay tuned. Number 1 Tip – Move Cells Without Replacing Cells In the table below, there are two columns showing months and the number of days. As you can see, the month of April was placed on row 10, which is supposed to be on row 8 just after the month of March. So I will highlight row 10 and drag it to row 7, it will ask you if you want to replace the row. So if I click OK, the month of May will be replaced, and row 10 is now blank. Let's undo this, and we will now try to use the Shift key. So we now select row 10. Press the Shift key then we drag it to row 7 then release the mouse and. See the result? The month of April is now below March, and all the rest are shifted underneath the row that we have placed. We will now go on the next tip. Number 2 tip. Insert many rows at a time. What we usually do is insert one row, then just press Ctrl Y to repeat the insert. This is a bit tricky because you have to place the mouse in the correct position in the cell. The position of the mouse should be at the cell in between the rows that you need to insert. Press the Shift key, then drag the mouse how many times you wanted to insert. See that there are no dialog box that appears. And the rows have been inserted. If you have any comments, kindly write it down below, and don't forget to subscribe in order to grow this channel. We will now move on to the next tip which is editing of cell across different sheets. The goal is to edit cells A2 of sheets ES1, ES2, and ES3. In order to do this, press the Shift key and select Sheets ES1, ES2 and ES3. Then go to cell A2 and then edit anything. I am typing at cell A2. See that other sheets are also edited. Even highlighting will affect other sheets that are selected. In order to cancel the multiple selection of the sheets, what you need to do is to select other sheets. The last tip that I am gonna show to you 
is to insert a perfect shape like square, triangle, circle and others. I am inserting a square and not holding the shift button. Notice that it is not a perfect square. But holding the shift key, it will become perfect square. Same with circle and triangle. This concludes my video. Thank you for watching and see you on my next video.